What's up, guys? Justin here, bringing you another poorly reviewed beer. Uh, still have some stuff in my fridge from before the holidays, so not getting into any of the Pennsylvania beers or the, the northern beers quite yet. This is still a, uh, a Carolina beer from Birdsong Brewing Company in Charlotte, North Carolina. This is Lazy Bird Brown Ale. And same thing on the other side. Notes from the, uh, the brewery on the can here. Your new favorite, our Lazy Bird Brown is the perfect beer for any season. Rich mahogany in color with hints of coffee and chocolate, this American-style brown ale is both smooth and sessionable. You'll discover a mild citrus hop flavor paired with pleasant aromas of roasted malt, making it a great brew for all occasions. Uh, it's 5.5% ABV, 45 IBU. Malts used include two-row victory red wheat, caramel 60L, roasted barley, and chocolate. Hops used include Columbus, Galena, Cascade, and Fuggle. Let's check it out. Mm. Getting a bit of a chocolate aroma off it already, I believe. Uh, still a little bit in here. It's a 16-ounce can. Uh, so I got most of it in the glass. And it is a pretty, pretty copper color. As I hold up the light, kind of holds that copper, goes into a bit of a more of a true orange color. And as you can see, a good uh, two fingers, maybe a little bit more worth of head. But really, really pretty beer. Um, as I've said in the past, my nose is not necessarily the greatest. I'm getting a whole bunch of chocolate, a whole bunch of caramel off it. Just, I'm not even holding up to my, my face. It's a good... You know, foot and a half, two feet from my nose, and I'm getting a little bit of aroma off it already. Let's go ahead and check it out. Yeah. Hmm. A little bit of nuttiness as well, I believe. Hmm. Not very sweet, but uh, some caramel notes, some chocolate notes, getting some nuttiness. whole bunch of coffee, especially... In the middle to back of the drinking experience, uh, frankly, it's getting just a, a hair bitter um, at the end and into the aftertaste. And now on the second sip, that that coffee is really, really taken, uh, really, really come to the fore. Really come to the front of the the flavor profile, almost overpowering some of the other things in there. It's a fairly bitter uh, coffee note as well. Almost a, I don't know, it's quite a dark roast, but I know a lot of uh, those dark roast coffee, the super dark roast coffees can be on the bitter side, and I'm getting a whole lot of bitterness, uh, and I believe it's out of the, the coffee note. Maybe just a hint of a, a, a cola note in there as well. Or maybe a brown sugar or something like that. There, on the second, third sip, there is something very slightly sweet to it, uh, but it's relatively minor. And again, uh, I've kind of lost the chocolate. I think I'm still getting maybe a little bit of the caramel, uh, as, as well as the other couple of uh, smaller notes or more minor notes that I've described. But uh, uh, coffee, strong roasted coffee, bitter coffee is kind of the what's taken over. Medium body, good amount of body. I would say medium, maybe pushing towards a towards a heavier body, just a, a hair. And um, a lot of the flavor notes come off relatively clean, but again, that the bitterness from that coffee just tends to really uh, really hang around through the drinking experience into the aftertaste. Um, and it's a little bit of a turnoff, frankly. Unfortunately, it's uh, just a little bit too much for me personally. Uh, I suppose some people that are maybe a little bit more of coffee heads than uh, than I am might 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 enjoy that note, but it's uh, just a little a little too harsh for me. Uh, so those are my thoughts on the the Birdsong Brewing Lazy Bird Brown, and that's it for this edition of Poorly Reviewed Beer. 
Uh, we'll be doing some stuff that I've had in my fridge still uh, for the rest of this week, and then a nice uh, uh, fun beer to do for the uh, for the weekend review. And we'll probably start getting into Pennsylvania beers and Northern beers uh, starting with next Tuesday's review. So that's what will be coming up in uh, the next few videos. You can find all my videos, both uh, but all my reviews, both video and written, along with news, commentary, and more at poorlyreviewedbeer.com. Also, check out PRB on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Untapped. You can find links and usernames in the description below. Also, feel free to like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you around at Poorly Reviewed Beer.